tournament. Villager, this is a character you don't see too much competitively, but mm -hmm. it's okay. kind of like it's, it's that's that with a lot of low tiers. When you see them, the people sticking with them know what they're doing. Yeah, he's one of the leading villagers too, so we're gonna uh, see a lot of good stuff. From him. He just eats that for breakfast. Ooh, and the up smash try to cover and approach. Pokemon doing a great job covering high, knowing Wario likes to jump in with aerials. That F smash is so powerful. Plants the tree. You know Poke Lamb. Very good for the environment. Thank you. Alright, I'm back. Poke Lamb off to a very great start. Oh! Great air dodge. That was a really good recovery, actually. I love that from BD Bean. Because yeah. he has that bike for that extra jump. I mean, it gives him a huge, a huge yeah. boost when he jumps yeah. out of it, so. Can put himself in no. an air dodge range to avoid Poker that. Pokeland here planting trees, trying to offset Wario's methane output. You know, carbon Help footprint. Him. Yep. Ooh. Yeah, and it's looking tough so far for BD Bean. Just not, not able to get in in the way that he can versus most characters. Yeah. Wario, Wario not exactly fast on the ground. Definitely not. And Villager loves to control airspace with that slingshot. So yeah, I don't know. It's looking rough. It's gonna be tough for BD Bean. And he can he can heal off of some of these projectiles, but it, it requires him to get so much space, so much separation. If Pokelam gets one good read on that bite, it might be over for BDB, and especially at this point. Yeah, we see him going for them, but in general, it's not it's not those, really doing much for him because he's taking a slingshot. Yeah, hit every those, those slingshots it. are going to be terrible because you can't go in with an air against them. Mm -hmm. They'll just send you back to. From oh, whence you came. quick back throw. Just like that back throw. No pummels from Pokemon. Definitely caught him slipping on the DI. Oh, and that's... Oh, wow. Wario, very, very quick air drift and fastball. Oh, definitely. Are you serious? Oh, my God. Switch sure over here right one. being sure a bozo, right as usual. But back oh, to the a, action yeah, here. Full stock lead from uh, Pokemon from Pokelam here. Honestly, I don't know. I'm not a Wario player, but I don't know what you would do in this matchup. This feels like one of those random matchups, which is very hard. Could be. I mean, he's looking at a WAF now, a full one, and if he pulls it soon enough, he could definitely, definitely get another one. Yeah, the possibility. With the speed that Villager likes one. to play neutral at, it's already been what two and a half. Ooh. Oh, but the top of the tree, you have to be careful. You gotta respect it. Yeah, and look at this gigantic lead now. Waft is much less of a concern for Pokemon, especially if he can hold on to this dog. He looks very comfortable yeah. against Wario. People say you say. have to play against Wario like you're on two stocks, but even so, he'd still have a one stock lead. Pokemon's doing fine here. Absolutely. Great up smash. Oh, oh, the Waft! Threw all the multi hits to that up smash. Good pull from, uh, from BD Bean, for sure. Yeah, and I'd like to see that confidence, you know, reinstate. Still in this. But he doesn't have time, really. I think we're going to have for to another see one. some slower play so Ooh. he gets another one. I don't even think a half is going to cut it, you know? Oh, Unless he can yeah, manage to take sure. this stock quickly. Up air, up air, up air. Vertical combos for that damage. I think, I think he's got Pokemon a little bit shook. Oh, uh, for sure. Definitely just the uh, surprising nature of that waft kill. Oh, but you cannot. Helping to bring it back. Not but contest that Lloyd Rocket. Yeah. You will lose the trade. Oh, now he's, he's got just, the bike, too. He just yeets the bike. You can't get another one when he pockets it, can you? Oh, uh, I don't believe so. Yeah, I, I guess it, we'll see. We'll see if he gets no, that No, you can't have two bikes on the stage at the same time, so. Oh, Ooh, that up smash could have killed him. Does not get the, the hits of that up smash. It's looking rough again, though. Pokemon, once again, like, establishing his, his stage control here. Pokemon. And, yeah, he does not have access to the bike. Which it gives him a, it gives him a different kind of like he needs yeah. to play it differently, knowing he can't go off stage either aggressively or defensively. He has to be careful. He really does. The bowling and ball that should set up Pokeland with those F, those uh, forward smashes off stage, but oh, that's just gonna do once it. Once again, you can't can't contest that. You know, his hands are big, but that rocket's bigger. Yeah. Great game one there from Pokemon. I mean, we oh, really 100%. saw like a, a pretty nice just stone wall for like 90% of that game. Yeah. I don't really know what you do as BD Bean, but I feel like he's the as the Wario player, he's got he he knows to figure something out. All 
All right, getting into game two here, same stage. Same, back on PS2. Beating me, actually a very big fan of PS2. Although I do wonder if the space might be too much. Uh, yeah, he might want something smaller. Is this best of three or best of five? It is best of three. Ah, uh, so. Uh, at the monthly, all top eight is best of five, but this still remains best of three. Ah, uh, nice. Ooh, great grab. Look at this conditioning. Pokelam almost knows when he's going to go high before BD Bean does. Catching him jumping in the first couple of frames of jumping that F smash. Oh, by that bowling ball. Not careful enough. You really always got to be thinking about it. Yeah. It'll and just kill you. One of the many things Villager has that will just kill you. Ooh, Pokelam getting a bit aggressive with that second slingshot. Oh, BD Bean can't, he can't get much off stage. Villager's Pokemon recovery is very, very clean good. with those recoveries, and PS2 does give him that little area to kind of stall under. Yeah, and Wario doesn't really have many tools to just hit the balloon. Because even if you nail through the balloons, you'll still probably hit Villager. But, but he's doing a great job here. Turnaround much bite, much better play. than last game for sure. Oh, oh and in the that back nice air. Conversion. I like it. BD Bean doing a much better job just not taking the unnecessary damage here, avoiding those big hits. Ooh, BD Bean putting on some damage here. Definitely a lot quicker. What y'all getting? <laughs> Shake Shack. Yo, yo, put me on that order, bruh. All right, I, I got to put my order in real quick. Yo, yo, real quick. I'll be telling people this. I don't work during the winter, but I just be getting money. Okay, I feel you. I got like 450 bucks today off some random shit. Some dude hit my car, bro. <laughs> you serious? Yeah. Snagged me four hundred fifty dollars off that shit. All right, back to the match. <laughs> <laughs> put me on that. Put me on that Shake Shack order, bro. Anyway, <laughs> got, back to the match. We got a very even, looking much much better for BDB. Oh, it looks definitely. Like he's taking the stage and began using it more to his advantage here. Yeah, for nice. sure. Oh, but there goes the bike. Just gotta make sure not to Ooh. overextend. And as I say, it jumps in a little too hastily. The tree, kind of setting up a, a situation where he feels yeah. like he needs to pressure from the air. You know, Pokelame out here, he really repoed the bike, so if he can get him off stage, it'd be a bad situation, but not at this percent. Ooh, in the up air, another move Villager has that you just gotta respect. You cannot challenge that. Not as Wario, anyway. Ooh, and that, sh that right. shield's getting dangerously low. Yeah. Pokelam here again, with the bike pocketed, with the stock lead. And yeah, he's just really taking his time. With that waft fully charged, there is nothing saying that Pokemon needs to approach. He won't overextend. He'll stay on the ground there, look for some damage, but he's really just playing it slow. Definitely, definitely. And yeah, exactly what Pokemon was looking for. BD Bean gets way too aggressive, overcommits hard. Pulls the waft and doesn't even get the kill for it. That's best case scenario. Yeah, Pokemon. definitely very unfortunate though. And avoids the down tilt dash tag. It is looking rough. Back to shades of game one here. And he catches that jump from left. Not enough, but this edge guard might look okay. Gets back. Pokemon bounces off that tree. Not gonna get his little fall animation from him riding that Lloyd. Oh, almost throws the tree right on him. Yeah, and he's just taking his time. He loves the second stock. He loves the stock lead. He definitely does. Gets the upper that will be enough with triple turnip. Good stuff to Pokemon. Really just impressed by the 